Ladies, I'm Sumi, and I'm back with another K-Culture video. If you guys can fall asleep when you're traveling Seoul, or if you guys don't know where to go at night in Seoul, I know exactly where you have to go. So today, I'm going to take you to the Dongdaemun Night Market trip. So Dongdaemun is a landmark of Seoul, and I know that you guys might heard of Dongdaemun before because it's so famous for the street food itself and the DDP Plaza behind me. Yes, but I'm going to take you to the Dongdaemun Night Clothing Market. So let's go. Fashion and shopping are two of the most highly associated words with Dongdaemun. The area was designated as Dongdaemun Fashion Town Special Tourist Zone in 2002 and it gives a completely different vibe from typical shopping malls. Here at Dongdaemun, visitors may enjoy a unique experience of both traditional flair markets as well as modern shopping complexes. So lots of foreign visitors come here and shop because since it's a wholesale market, lots of products are mostly super cheap. And as for me, as I'm in like working 9 to 6, I don't have time in the daytime, so this is the perfect place for me to shop. The reason why this whole market opens late at night is that all of the customers are the business owners from different cities, so they have to pick up their materials over the night so that they can sell it the next day. So before you start your shopping, you have to make sure to wear comfortable clothes and comfortable sneakers, and you have to like bring your cash because they don't accept your any credit cards or debit cards so I brought my cash. I really want to like buy like legit clothes that I am gonna wear tomorrow because I'm gonna go to like K-pop festival tomorrow and I wanna find some clothes for that festival. <laughs> this is so unique. <laughs> Wings. <laughs> oh, this one is cute too. But the problem is that this, since this is a wholesale market, you have to buy like two different things. Even though you, you like this clothes, then you can't just buy this one single thing. You have to buy the other color of this design or maybe different size. So they have like these kind of different colors. So if I want to buy it, I have to buy these two together. I want to buy this. Hey, it's going to really go well with my jeans. And all these products goes to different shopping malls in Korea and even to China because Chinese love to wear Korean style, like fashion clothes. So there are many different buildings, but they sell slightly different things. For example, this building mainly sells like women clothes, but if you go to other buildings, for example, like Gwangi Fashion Mall, they sell like men products, leather goods and wallets. So if you guys are specifically finding something, then you have to do a little, little research, otherwise you're gonna get lost. Until now, I was at the modernized shopping mall, but just across the street, you can easily find traditional shopping mall too. So let's go! Starting from here, this area is called as traditional flair market. So like only $10 for these 7 pairs. So I'm gonna buy it. Oh, and I see like they're selling also bags and shoes. So I guess it's gonna be interesting if you guys come with your mom or parents or like family members because you can find like all different kinds of clothes and like fashion accessories from here. This place is hectic. <laughs> And you can easily see these people who are packing outside, we call them buying uncles. So what they do is, for example, I am the CEO of the shopping mall and are the one who buys and do the delivery instead of me. You know, if the business gets bigger, you can't do things all by yourself, right? So that's why people are so busy outside because they have to send the products on time. Another unique feature from here is that all the restaurants and cafes are open until the late night, you know, since it means a lot of energy even though we are just shopping. Yeah, maybe that's the reason why. So I've ordered one shike and one tteokbokki. Mm. You know what, guys? It's a tragedy because it's already 11.48 p.m. And I've walked like 11,974 steps today to find a clothes that I have to wear for the tomorrow's hip hop festival but I haven't found a single item. Actually, I found something that I really want to buy but the problem is that I have to buy two things from there, you know, since it's a wholesale market. So I'm still considering because it was kind of 
cute but expensive to buy two things together and I didn't like the other colors. So I was considering to buy this one before but I've decided my mind to buy these two because I love these two colors, both colors, so I'm gonna buy this one. Oh, I finally bought it! <laughs> I came to Dongdaemun right after I got up from my work and I was so amazed because it was even more crowded than I thought. And second, since I see so many foreigners here, I think K-fashion is gonna astonish the world as K-drama and K-pop did. See, I also bought things. This place is so amazing. If I was just staying in my house, I'd just leave at this time, so it even makes me feel like I spend my time so efficiently. I highly recommend you guys to come visit Dongdaemun Fashion Town. So don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. And if there is any place that you want me to visit in South Korea, please leave a comment below. So bye! Okay guys, so this is the sweater I bought yesterday. And I love this so much because it kind of looks like a hipster and very artsy, you know. I like this neon color. And so I'm gonna go out and enjoy my hip hop festival, hip hop festival today. So bye guys!